Hey what's up everyone, it's Brian from GumballTech.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to replace the hard drive in the MacBook Pro. Now the one in mine is a 320 gig 5400 RPM drive and it's just been going bad lately. There's a bunch of bad sectors everywhere on it and things are freezing and going really slow. It's been doing this for the past couple of months so I just can't take it anymore. So I just went out to CompUSA and I bought this 500 gig 7200 RPM drive. Now with the extra spindle speed you should get a considerable boost in performance. It was only $90 for the 500 gig so I mean if you're looking for a new drive this is definitely the one. It's the cheapest one I've been able to find as well. So let's get started. Now on the bottom plate of your computer there are 10 screws all around it and once you take all those out with the normal Phillips head screwdriver just take the bottom plate off and all the inner workings of your computer are revealed such as the battery, CPU, second GPU, optical drive, and then your hard drive. Now for the hard drive there are four screws. There's one here, here. It's sort of hard to see because they're black. Okay that's a little better. There's one here, here, and there's one here and here. Now I already took these out and then, but for the the right side of the drive, you just have to take the little black thing off, and then you can pull the drive out. But be, care, be, a, be a little bit careful because there's a ribbon cable for the SATA connector, so you just need to pull the little connector off. Okay, so here is our original 320 gig hard drive from Apple. You see the Apple logo. It's made by Hitachi. Okay, so we'll put that one to the side. I'm going to stick that in the into a little enclosure that I bought today as well. Open up the new one. Let's see what we get. Installation information. Eh, nobody reads that junk. So let's see. We have the hard drive in our fancy looking moisture barrier bag 500 gigs nice so we're going to get some scissors and open this up and here is our fancy new faster bigger drive we're just going to compare it with the original apple one it's they're pretty much the same design except this one has an apple on it so put that one over there, clean up a little bit. Okay, now the original hard drive that was in your MacBook is going to have four screws on the side. Now this is a new drive, so they're not there. You're, you're going to have to take those screws out and then put them on here to securely fasten the drive into the computer. So for the sake of this video, we're just going to pretend that those are already on here because I don't know how to take the other screws out because I don't know what sort of thing they are. So we're going to take our SATA connector and hook it up. Okay, so it's on there and... And that's it. So then you just put your screws back. Then you put your bottom plate back. Put all 10 screws back on, and you're done. So that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, just leave a comment for this video, and we'll see you next time.